Hello my lovelies, today I'm going to show you what I got in my Generation Beauty swag bag and if you don't know what Generation Beauty is, it is an event that was held by Ipsy and Ipsy was co-founded by Michelle Fawn which she is a YouTuber on YouTube, a beauty guru and it was basically an event for beauty creators and beauty lovers to come together and meet and network and socialize and just try new brands and basically just have fun and learn. It's, it was a really good learning experience. Um, if you were a beauty creator, they had lots of workshops going on where um, a lot of different gurus would give you tips and advice on how to improve your YouTube channel. So it was a really, really good, fun event if you are a beauty lover or a YouTuber. So, And a beauty creator could be anyone. It doesn't need to, it, you don't have to be a YouTube guru. You can be, take pictures on Instagram, you can be a blogger, you can be just basically um, any social network that you create your beauty and share it with others. So that's what a beauty creator was. But um, when you register, you get this little pamphlet and inside they had little tickets that you can go to each booth that was there at the event and they would give you a, a, a little sample or a full size product so um, when you registered you also got this bag so I'm going to show you all the things I got and you might want to grab some popcorn and your purple drink because this is going to be a very long video because this is fully loaded it was definitely more than I could have ever expected it was all the brands were very generous so I'll go ahead and show you what I got. Okay, so I'll show you what we got the first day and the second day and then a little bit about the booth. So for Temp2, which is this brand, the first day we got an under eye concealer and the bag and then in the line people were coming around and color matching everyone. So it looks like this. So it has a concealer and it looks like maybe like a moisturizer in the center. It's really nice packaging. It feels really good. And then the second day, we got a base smooth and matte primer, which also came in a bag. And what was going on in that booth is um, a lot of girls were getting their hair braided. It seemed like that's what their specialty was because everyone that went in there got some sort of braid styled hair, tap or hair um, look and they put little flowers in all the girls hair so it was really cute and I didn't go in that booth but I saw a lot of girls walking around with really cute hairstyles so that one was really fun the second one the second booth that I want to show you is Bare Minerals and the first day we got a little eyeshadow palette this looks like that and then the second day, we got a lip gloss. So this is a Moxie lip gloss. And they had different colors going around. And what was cool about the Bare Minerals booth is that they had like little, little mini giveaways going on. So if you went and you tried on one of the lip glosses or lipsticks and you took a picture of yourself and tweeted it or posted it on Instagram with hashtag Generation Beauty, hashtag Moxie, something like that they would give you a full size lipstick so I thought that was really nice of them and then you can just choose whatever color you want and they would give it to you so they did that for the first and the second day so for the first day I got this color which is the Marvelous Moxie Never Say Never and these this packaging is really cool so you push the little button you push it down and then the lipstick comes out so I got this color which is just a really bright pink and these feel really nice when you put them on. They feel really smooth and velvety and very hydrating. And then the second color I got the next day was Marvelous Moxie and Fly High, which is kind of like a um, pink with lavender undertones, which I was really happy because the first day they ran out of this color, so I ended up getting the bright pink. So the next day they had more of these, so I was really happy I was able to get it. And then this next booth was the pixie booth and for the first day uh, pixie and soho london and new york 
um, teamed up together, so they gave it and they gave they gave away their um, their goodies together. So we got this little cosmetic case from Soho, which is super cute because if you unzip the bottom of it, it has a place for your makeup brushes as well as a mirror. So I thought that was really cute. And from Pixie, what came inside was from Pixie and we got a Endless Silky Eye Pen and Oyster Glow, which is just a really pretty champagne color. Whoa, and it's very, very smooth and silky. And then we got a Eye Bright Primer a lid lash shadow pen in the color mocha mauve which I love these because they really do stay put you could put these on your lid and they're not going to go anywhere so that's a really nice pretty taupe color and then we got a lip blush and this is in the color purity and I love the way these smell they smell so they just smell really fruity like candy and that's the swatch of this so I was like whoa when I opened this, I was like, we got all that in there? That was amazing because I love, love Pixie products. And then the next booth over is the Soho Beauty booth. And so that first day we got, um, oh, and at Bare Minerals and Pixie, they were having um, little makeovers or at Bare Minerals, they were having make-unders and then, which was just their take on natural beauty or uh, the no makeup makeup look I believe and then um, Pixie was just doing like little demos they were doing makeup which is really fun for all the beauty pe all the beauty lovers attending because you got to do little activities in each booth so the Pixie was doing that and then the Soho London we got that little cosmetic case the first day and the second day um, I believe you got to choose a brush so I got a foundation brush and at that booth they had a little area where you can design your own uh, cosmetic case and they had a raffle so that was really fun and then the next booth is tattoo or tattoo you and the first day we got this which I believe is just kind of like um, body art accessory you can kind of just put a tattoo on so I chose the color blue and then the second day we got a lip gloss with a little coupon code this is a really nice hot pink and it is super pigmented. Go ahead and swatch it really fast for you guys. I hope, this, I hope this video is not like 30 minutes long because there's a lot of stuff to go through. But um, this is extremely pigmented. I don't know if you can see it there. But it's like bam. It looks like it's really good stuff. I haven't tried it yet. And the top feels like the NARS casing, like that suede type of feel to it. And I'm not sure, I don't think they were having anything going on at that booth, if I remember. And then the next booth over was the BH Cosmetics. And the first day, I picked out, they had like a couple of things that you can choose from. So they had a variety of... Um, goodies that you can get you just had to choose one so the first day I got this makeup brush belt which I was like wow I couldn't believe they were giving this away so I got that because I thought that would be very helpful for me and then the second day I got a gel eyeliner in the color night which looks like a very beautiful very um, royal purple kind of a deep deep purple but when she had it swatched on her on her hand it looked more like of a navy blue so yeah it's kind of it looks like it would be purple in the jar but it's more of a kind of like a dark navy blue color when you swatch it so I thought that was really fun and they were actually selling some of their products so I got the 120 palette and that's what I'm wearing today I used it today on my eyeshadow. Okay, and the next booth over was the sexy hair booth. And that booth was really fun. You can get your hair done by a stylist and they could do basically anything. It wasn't like you had to choose from different looks. 
they would do basically whatever you requested. And the first day, we got this big sexy hair powder play. So this is supposed to be volumizing and texturizing powder. They said that if you have trouble teasing your hair, that this would be a good product because it holds the tease so that it doesn't fall down. And then the second day, we got this healthy, sexy hair soy renewal beach spray, which um, is supposed to hydrate your hair because it has argan oil. So a lot, I guess a lot of beach sprays can leave your hair feeling really dry. And this one will give you the beach waves or beach hair look without drying out your hair because it has argan oil in it. And I actually got my hair done in that booth and I had a really crazy um, Katy, Katy Perry inspired hairdo which was like a French twist and then I had a really huge wave in the front which I have a picture right here that I can show you. It looked like this. You can see it. I have a whole bunch of pictures on my Instagram um, of the event if you want to check out like all the things that I did. Um, my my Instagram username is just Makeup Monster. It's really easy to find. Okay, and then the next one is Benefit. And the first day, we got the little um, Benefit tint, Benetint, which I'm sure you guys all have heard about. It's like, it's just a little, it looks like nail polish, but it's a cheek tint. And they were having a special little um, kind of, giveaway for the first hundred people in line to redeem their little gift. If you tweeted your favorite benefit um, product and hashtag Gen Beauty, they would give you a full size. So of course I did that. I got in on that and I got the full size of the Benetint. And then the second day, same thing. This was the sample, which is their real mascara. And if you tweeted, the first hundred people would get the full size. So of course I got in on that too because I was like, heck yeah, I really like this mascara. And at that booth they had um, a really fun photo booth for all the guests and uh, you had your little props, which I showed you just now. So I got this one from that booth. It was really fun. A lot of people would go there when they were just walking around and they had nothing to do, then they just go there. Oh, I totally forgot to show you what we got for Pixie the second day. We got um, this mascara, large lash mascara from Pixie, and this was the second day they gave this to us, which I was really excited because I really wanted to try this mascara, and this is the one. And we got the color Best Brown. The next booth was Makeup Forever, and the first day we got a new uh, mascara that's going to come out soon. And then the second day, we got a little aqua eyeliner. And they were having little makeup um, demos there too, so you can go and get your get your eyes done, contouring, or your lips done. Which I also did the second day, that was really fun. And then the next booth was the NYX booth, and oh my god, I was so shocked when I saw what they were giving away. You can choose from so many palettes that you wanted. So the first day I chose the next Boheme, Boheme Chic Nude, Nude Matte Collection. So I got this palette here and then you slide it down and you get two blushes and some more eyeshadows. So I got this the first day. I was just like, whoa! I thought it was just going to be like a little lips. A little lip product or something you know but I thought that was really generous and I was really excited and then the second day you guys are not gonna believe this I got this yeah this is huge it has all kinds of stuff in here so you open it up you get all these eyeshadows and some lip products some blushes some bronzers whoa stuff is falling out but yeah, that was extremely, ex extremely generous, and I was super excited. I can't wait to use this. But yeah, this is completely free, you guys. And I, I still can't believe it. That's just amazing. And at the NYX booth, they had the NYX Face Awards. So if you went and you voted for the person that you wanted to vote for and wore a pin, which I can't find right now, but it was a pin that just said that you voted and you wore it, if you were wearing it, they they would give you a little 
a little mini giveaway of this here. So randomly someone would just come by and if they saw you with it on, then they, they would give you this little, this little mini giveaway. And what came inside here is the Smoky Fume NYX palette. This is the Wonder Pencil, which I'm not too sure what what that means, but it's in the color medium. You got some NYX blotting paper. A NYX Glam lipstick. And I got Pink Jewel. And I was super excited because they put a butter gloss in there. And you guys know that I've been loving the butter glosses. And I don't have this color, so I was even more excited. And this is the color Tiramisu. And it's another really nice nude, which I love nudes. And then the last thing is this Born to Glow Liquid Illuminator. So NYX was really awesome. I, I, I thought it was really good, the stuff they gave out. The next brand is Anastasia Beverly Hills. And you guys all know that she's the brow queen. And of course, in that booth, they were doing brow demos. So you can go sit down and they would do your brows for you and recommend some products for you. And the first day, they gave us a um, lash, lash Genius. And this makes any mascara that you have waterproof, which I really like because that their Real Benefit mascara kind of smudges on my lower lashes. So I'm going to use that for this or use this for that. And then the second day, they gave us a clear brow gel, which looks like this. And then for Proactive, the first day we got this refining mask, and it's a really good size. And the second day, we have the green tea moisturizer, as well as the sheer cover, or sheer cover like a smoky eye palette, which has really beautiful colors in there. I'm not too sure if they had anything going on in that booth because I walked by several times and it didn't seem like anything was going on so I'm not sure if they had stuff they were doing anything there and then the next booth is Pacifica which I got a body mist from there that smells amazing it is Tahitian Gardenia and it smells really good I've already gotten like so many compliments on it which I like that they were selling some of their products because um, a lot of their products were on display and we're like, oh, I want this, I want that. And they were giving it like for really cheap prices, so we had to take advantage. The first day, they gave us a Dreamy Youth Day and Night Face Cream. Looks like that. And then the second day, they gave us a Color Quench Lip Tint in Guava Berry, which looks like this. And then they have the Nicole OPI booth, which of course they were giving free manicures, which my friend Flo was like, I want to get my nails done. So I was like, well then go to the OPI, they're doing it for free. So she got her nails done and she had a really cute color. I forgot to ask her what color it was, but it was a really nice like peachy color. And then the first day they gave out this nail polish and all these polishes are from the Selena Gomez um, line and this is in the color kissed at midnight and then the second day they gave us this one which is hit the lights which is a very very vibrant vibrant yellow and I'm probably going to use this to paint like my toes or something because I like fun colors like this on my toes and then let's see almost done so okay so when you first get there there was a treasure hunt for Smashbox to get your little prize and you had to take a picture in front of the Smashbox graffiti wall and then use the hashtags. Uh, the second thing you, you had to tweet that you were at Generation Beauty. The third thing is that you had to take a picture with five people from Generation Beauty and then uh, tweet it or no you just had to take a picture with five people in front of a restaurant and then you had to take a picture with five people again in front of three they just gave you clues so you had to figure it out. One was um, the Grammy Museum, another one was like the Nokia something. So anyways, you have to do all those things to get this. And this was the Smashbox. They gave us a lip gloss and this is in the color Illume, which is a nice nude with silver glitters in it. 
a mascara. This one is Full Exposure Mascara. This little lip, uh, no, sorry, this little eyeshadow palette. This one is it's just called Sand, Vapor, and Thunder. Looks like that. And then the last thing in here is the Smashbox Photo Finish Luminizing Oil Free. So I guess it's like a, lum a luminizer, just a luminator. Little sample there. And then on the last day when you were leaving the event, they would give you a Ipsy bag. So I got this one. They had like different ones, which I was really happy that I got this one because I didn't get this bag because um, I changed my credit card so they didn't, they didn't bill me in time and I didn't get this one. So I'm glad I got the one that I didn't get. And so it's just, this has magnet, uh, this is like magnetized, which I'm going to use for my bobby pins. And then this has a makeup remover wipes. Which if you got this glam bag you or, or this ipsy bag, you already know. Um, Coastal scents. And then this hydrating mist by Juicy Beauty or Juice Booty. Juice Beauty. Juice booty. <laughs> and then this Yabby. Yabby um, eyeshadow in seashell. So if you want to know what my experience was at Generation Beauty, then stay tuned because I will do a second video of my experience and what I thought of it. The good, the bad, the ugly. And yeah, so just stay tuned if you want to know more about it. But overall, I would say that it's a really, really fun event. And I was happy that I got a chance to go. And I had a lot of fun and I'm definitely, definitely going to go again next year if they're having it again because um, I got to meet new people and I learned a lot. Well, not too much, but I learned at the event, at all the workshops that I actually made time to attend. But it was a really fun experience, so I definitely, definitely would go again. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope it's not too, too long. And yeah, I will see you in my next video.